Hey guys, Sarah here. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be talking all things Dermalogica. I have tried a bunch of their products recently and since they are a bit more expensive, I wanted to test them out and just see what is actually worth your money and what is not. I haven't tried everything from their line. I have four, I have nine products in front of me, which I feel like is a pretty decent amount. So let's jump right into it. All right, I have my laptop in front of me so that I can read all of the claims about each product. The first one is the Special Cleansing Gel. This one is $37 and it says it's a soap-free foaming gel, cleanses all skin conditions, refreshing lather, thoroughly removes impurities without disturbing the skin's natural moisture balance. I definitely agree with that. I think that it was a really awesome cleanser. If you guys have been following me for any amount of time, you know that I have been using the CeraVe cleanser for years. My dermatologist recommended it to me and I really don't sway away from it. But I was sent this cleanser and so I did want to test it out and just see if it was worth the money. And honestly, I don't think that it is. I really, really enjoyed it and I thought it was definitely very lathering. You use the smallest amount and it will literally lather your entire face. It leaves your skin feeling really nice and like supple. It doesn't feel dried out at all, which is really awesome. I don't really have anything bad to say about this. I just don't think that $37 for a cleanser is worth it for me personally. But that being said, it's an amazing cleanser. So if you do want to splurge on a cleanser, I totally recommend this one. It is awesome. And I think that like splurging on your skincare is way better than splurging on makeup. So if you're going to save anywhere, save on your makeup. Um, I just really personally still love my CeraVe cleanser and I would rather splurge on other skincare items than a cleanser. All right, next up is this. It is the Dynamic Skin Recovery. It's a broad spectrum F SPF 50 and it's from their Age Smart line. This online says that it helps minimize skin aging triggers with this medium weight emollient daily moisturizer with broad spectrum SPF 50. This is 1.7 fluid ounces and it is $69, which is insane for a moisturizer in my opinion. Um, it comes with a little pump and it's just this white formula and it is pretty thick. I'm not the biggest fan of the smell. It doesn't smell like a normal SPF, but it does. It just doesn't smell that great to me, but it leaves your skin with a nice natural sheen. It's a little bit glowy. Um, it's definitely a great product to start your day off with, but it's a little bit thick for me to want to wear under my makeup. Um, in the summer, I like something that's a little bit thinner, especially because you're outside and you're sweaty. And I just have found other moisturizers, moisturizers that also have SPF that are a little bit thinner that I prefer over this one. All right, next up is another moisturizer. This is the Active Moist. And this says, um, sheer, easy to apply Active Moist formula contains silk amino acids and a unique combination of plant, plant extracts to help improve skin texture and combat surface dehydration. Um, this one is 1.7 fluid ounces and it is $40. So it's definitely still expensive, but honestly, I recommend this like crazy. It is just such a great formula. Um, again, it's just this white formula and it blends out. It's like so sheer and so thin to wear under your makeup. You literally barely have to wait any amount of time before you put your makeup on. You don't have to wait for like a really heavy cream to be sitting in your skin. Um, this just blends in so easily. It leaves your face with a really nice feeling. It feels hydrated and nourished and I cannot say enough good things about this. If you're in the market for a new moisturizer, definitely check this one out. And I think it does come in another size. Yeah, it comes in a 3.4 ounce as well, which is $60. All right, moving on. This is the Daily Microfoliant, and this is 2.6 ounces and it's $55. It says, gentle daily use exfoliating powder for all skin conditions. Unique rice-based powder formula activates upon contact with water, releasing pepain, salicylic acid, and rice enzymes that microexfoliate dead cells, instantly leaving skin smoother and brighter. I cannot say enough good things about this. I. I'm obsessed with it. I've been using it like crazy. It's sitting in my shower. I had to grab it out of the shower actually to uh, bring it in for this video. And it comes with just these little holes and you just dump out a little bit of the powder in your wet hands and then you just rub it together and you put it on your skin and just like massage it into your skin. It leaves your skin so soft and it makes make putting on makeup so much easier. So I love this. I think it's a great exfoliator. 
Um, it is expensive, it's $55, but this is a lot of product. You don't go through that much. You just use the smallest amount and um, you don't have to use it every single day. I use mine about every two to three days and it works perfectly. I, I just absolutely love this stuff. Um, the one downfall is I hate the smell of it. I think it smells terrible. I don't even have a comparison of what it smells like, but I just hate, hate, hate the smell of it. So that is a downfall for me, but it is something that you wash off your face right away. It's not like a moisturizer or makeup that's sitting on your face all day. So it doesn't bother me. I just get it over with and then rinse it off and it's not a big deal. Speaking of things that are in my shower, this one also is, this is the pre-cleanse. This is 5.1 fluid ounces and it is $42. So it says deep cleansing and oil melts impurities and makeup from skin. As the first step in your double cleanse regimen, pre-cleanse thoroughly melts away layers of excess oil, sunscreen, waterproof makeup, pollutants, and products that build up on your skin, allowing your prescribed Dermalogica cleanser to penetrate even further for professional cleansing results. So um, I'm sure you guys have seen tons of cleansing oils and balms and everything all over the market. And this is one of the first ones that I've tried. The only other one that I've tried that's um, like an oil balm is the Clinique, I think it's the Take the Day Off Balm. I believe that's what it's called. Um, I like this one a lot better. This sits in my shower and I just put one pump into my hands and then rub it into my dry hands onto my dry face and just really massage it in and then wash it off. And then I go on and still wash my face with my cleanser. Um, I, I'm i not the biggest fan of, of oils in general. Um, I think, I don't know if I'm, if anyone else is like this, but if I'm going to wash my face, when I wash my face at night, I would rather use a makeup wipe to remove my makeup instead of an oil because I already have to wash my face and like put the water on it and that whole thing that I don't like to do that twice. I don't know if that's just super lazy or what, but if I am taking a shower and I have makeup on, then I will use this to remove my makeup in the shower. So I don't know if that makes sense to anyone else. If you guys are like this, let me know down below in the comments. I can't be the only one, but yeah, I'm just not a big fan of using two different things that I then have to wash off with water at night or when I'm taking my makeup off. So I do really like it if you do like cleanser, if you do like oil cleansers, I'm sure you would love this one. It is so great and you only need one pump to really get off your entire face of makeup. Next up, this is one of my favorite products. This actually made it into my everyday makeup bag. I cannot get enough of it. This is the Hydra Blur Primer and it comes with 0.75 fluid ounces and it is $47. It says this lightweight, non-greasy primer minimizes the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles, mattifies against oil shine, and impacts, imparts a silky, luminous finish to skin. And honestly, this stuff is just absolutely amazing for my skin. I have bigger pores right in this area on my cheeks, and honestly, you put it on, and it just looks like my, peer, my pores are disappearing in front of my eyes, which is absolutely amazing. If you have problems with your pores, I would highly recommend this. I've tried so many different ones and I, I have other primers that I like as well, but I just really, I love this one. I love the formula of it. Um, it's just this white formula. I think everything I've shown you today has just been a white formula. Um, and it just smooths, oh my gosh, it just like disappears into your skin so quickly and it leaves your skin so soft and ready for makeup. I cannot say enough good things about it. If there's one thing from this video, that's a lie, I have a tie between my top two products and the other one I haven't talked about yet, but one of my top two products from this entire video is this primer. I highly, highly, highly recommend it if you're in the market for a new primer. All right, this is the Stress Positive Eye Lift. This one comes with 0.85 fluid ounces and it is $65. It says, active cooling cream gel mask energizes skin to reduce visible signs of stress. High performance formula minimizes the appearance of puffiness and dark circles, increases skin luminosity, and lifts the eye area and helps restore skin barrier integrity. And this stuff really is great. I like to use this in the morning if I am putting makeup on right when I first wake up and my eyes are still a little bit puffy. Um, this is what the applicator looks like, which I think is super interesting. It's just a metal applicator. And you just put a little bit it's kind of like a gel. It's almost clear, but also has a little bit of a white tint. And you just put this very gently around your eyes and kind of massage it in. And then you let it sit there for like two to three minutes. And it just makes the skin kind of depuff and gets you ready to put makeup on. It leaves your skin so nice and it just feels so great. And if you have any access, you can just rub it in. 
um, gently of course because it is your eye area but I think this is awesome I don't really suffer from dark circles that much but my eyes definitely are puffy when I first wake up if I'm putting makeup on so in that case I absolutely love it and if you do suffer from dark circles I can't speak for this if it works for those but I'm sure definitely give it a try I'm sure that it would next up is this it's the phyto replenish oil and this comes with one ounce and it is $75 the website says this feather light treatment oil rapidly absorbs to reinforce the skin's protective barrier. Wear it alone or layer it under foundation for all day dewy skin. So this stuff, oh my gosh, I cannot say enough good things about this. I feel like I've said that a million times in this video, but so many of these products are just so amazing. Um, this one is awesome. I love that it sinks into your skin so easily. It comes with this little um, applicator, I don't know what to call it. I like when oils come like this instead of with the dropper because I feel like the dropper is so much harder to travel with and this you can just put the, ta the um, top back on and it screws on and you can travel with it easily. Uh, anyway, you just put a couple of drops into your fingers um, and it's just a clear oil and then you can just pat it into your skin um, and it just leaves your skin so nice. It makes your skin feel so supple and it just feels like you're doing such a big favor to your skin. Um, I love the way that this just sinks in and makes my skin feel. I've noticed that the texture of my skin has really been changing and this has really helped me. I have tons of skin issues and I really feel like this has really helped change my skin for the better. So I highly recommend this. Um, I usually wear this alone. I don't ever wear this under makeup, but I I actually didn't even know you could wear it under makeup until reading this. So I think I'm going to try that. I usually wear it at night. So I think I might swap and try wearing it in the morning before I put my makeup on and just use a different serum at night. But um, I definitely love this. I highly recommend it. Definitely worth the price tag in my opinion. Last but certainly not least, this is the Nightly Lip Treatment. This is new and it's in their Age Smart line. It comes with 0.34 ounces and it's $49. It says this anti-aging lip treatment smooths the appearance of laugh and feather lines while you sleep. This rich overnight formula firms, hydrates, and restores skin on and around the lips. So this one comes with that same applicator from the under eye mask and you just pump out the smallest amount and then you just put it onto your lips right before you go to bed. It has a bit of a tingling sensation but I actually really really like it and I love this. It has made my lips actually smoother. Not just like a mask or you know a moisturizer that says it transforms your skin. This actually has transformed my lips. I highly recommend this. I think it's amazing. This is probably the best lip product I've ever used that's supposed to help hydrate or repair your lips. I think that this actually does it and I cannot recommend it enough. All right, I don't know if you can see it on my lips, but I just put that on it, be on my lips because I don't wanna waste it. It's just so good that any amount, I'm like, I cannot waste it. I need to just use it right now. Um, anyway, that is all of the products that I have been testing out from Dermalogica. I hope that this helped you and maybe it helped you sway you in one direction or another about one of the products that's amazing or one that's maybe not worth your money or just not something that you're looking for at the moment. Um, if you did enjoy this video, please make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below so you don't miss any of my future videos. Thanks so much for watching. See you guys later.